Well, here we are. I took apart my Road King because as much as I like the way it looks, I really don't like that black flat crinkle or wrinkle, whatever they call it, finish. And the powder coat that it comes with. You know, throughout years, it, it throughout the years, it gets matte. It gets grayish. It just looks darn ugly after a while. So, I took her apart, and when I took her apart, I did, you know, the standard, you know, checking the, um, checking the, the cylinders, the pistons, run out, tension, and I had emailed the uh, a sandblasting service here in Chicago send them a picture of one set you know of uh, heads of a head and cylinder got a quote back for 80 bucks for two 150 bucks for sandblasting well quite frankly yeah, that's that's a bit much so went online, look at some YouTube videos, some forums, and sure enough, this is what I used. Aircraft paint remover. This shit's strong. Oh man. I took a whiff of it by mistake and it was burning. It is stronger than ammonia. It is it is strong. So what I did was, I put a little mustard bottle, I put it inside the mustard bottle, ran in between the fins, it's pretty thick, and all you do is let it work, and lord and behold, look at this, just by itself, it's working, I'm not doing any harsh or hard movements I'm not really you know, there's no breaking of sweat here which is great <laughs> it's just coming off it's outstanding so I imagine if I were to leave it inside a bag a sealed bag uh, don't leave it overnight look at this just this, this has been not even 10 minutes and it's coming off by itself so you got to be careful not to uh, ruin your aluminum. Make sure it doesn't eat through it. This is fabulous. So I'm thinking that I might paint this. And then grind out. You know, highlight the uh, the edge of the fins. You know, make sure they're shining. So I think uh, I might do just a uh, high gloss black. Or I might even do... You know, the color of the tank I don't know I'll figure it out once uh, once I get it stripped but this is typically I bought it at Pet Boys for it was at 39 bucks a gallon a little expensive it was on promotion $10 off so I bought it for 28 bucks a gallon which was even great even better I'm happy. Just a uh, well ventilated area. I have a fan up here. I'm gonna use some gloves, some eye protection, you know, do the whole thing. Smooth. I'll put it up in another video once I get it all stripped.